Are you ready? Sly Gittins here with another security tip. But today we're going to be talking about the top three certifications for newcomers into IT. So if you're a beginner and you're not sure where you need to start, this video is for you. If you're doing a career change, changing fields, this video is for you. Let's build that baseline fundamental knowledge to get you into IT because we could use your help because as you know, IT is a boom and fail and it's going to continue as the years progress to be a very crucial area to get involved in. So let's talk about the CompTIA A plus certification. If you have no knowledge of computers, you want to start here. The ZAM covers maintenance of PCs, mobile devices, laptops, operating systems, and printers. So why do you want to know that? Because everything in IT builds off of these fundamental knowledge. What you want to understand is the basics of computer technology. You want to know the installation, the configuration of PCs, laptops, and other um, related hardware. And you need to get a great grasp of basic networking skills and in addition you need to understand how to install and configure PC operating systems as well as for mobile operating systems such as Android and Apple devices so you might say Sylvester I already know a lot about computers so prove it then take the certification pass it because the way I look at it is not only do you already know the content it also checks off a box when you're looking in um, to gaining your entry level role and plus it's a great negotiation tactic to get more money in that interview if you could come in into an entry level role and say I have my A plus certification and you're going to going for uh, a computer help desk role or a technician role this can give you some more money in that negotiation period the next one I want to talk about is the Network Plus certification. And this is great after you take the A Plus certification because not only is it vendor neutral, but it goes over the basic understandings of network technology, installation and configuration, medium topology, management, and security. So some people who will benefit if you're going into the network administrator field, network technician, a network installer, help desk technician, IT cable installer. These are some of the people who will leverage this, but just think about it. You're watching me on YouTube or some type of social media channel. Channel. You had to A, get onto a wireless network, a hardwire network to be able to watch this. So this is learning the behind the scenes of understanding how a network works, right? And the great thing about it, a lot of the companies require their engineers to have this certification. So it, in, it is in demand is a great place to start before you start taking those vendor specific certifications, right? So a lot of people might say, Sylvester, you should start off with a, C, um, a Cisco certification like a CCNA, CCNT, but that's if you want to go the route of Cisco. But what if you want to do something like Juniper? What if you want to do Palo Alto Networks, right? So start off with a Network Plus gather that basic fundamental knowledge and then choose the the path that you want to go down with the network capabilities the next one is security plus certification this is great because security is hot is here to stay and as our networks become more robust and more connected we need to know how to protect ourselves from cybersecurity threats so this is a great entry level certification to start again it's going to be vendor neutral and that's great because now you're just learning those fundamental security principles that you need to understand you need to understand what is network security what is compliance and operating security threats and vulnerabilities application and data and host security and so on and so forth this will help you become well-rounded and understand the basics of IT security so as a recap what do we cover here today the A plus certification to get your basic understanding of computers, mobile devices, PC, laptops, and printers. Also, our network um, plus certification that goes over the fundamentals of how a network works, the different topologies, the different types of medias, and also some security practices on how you can be efficient managing your network. 
And then lastly, we talked about the Security Plus certification. And this is great if you want to get your foot in the door with cybersecurity, understanding the fundamental principles. I hope you found this very valuable. And if you did, hit the like button, hit the share button. Make sure to subscribe and click the bell to stay notified.